Full Fun Fact. Did you know that since ancient times people have used twigs as toothbrushes? Well, now you know. It's jaw time with Mr. Mayberry. Time to draw. Hi, welcome to Draw Time with Mr. Mayberry, Fall Time Edition. It's Nature Walk Week on Draw Time, so we're drawing things that you would see if you go on a nature walk. Today I'm going to show you how to draw a twig. So let's get started. It's time to draw. Okay, today I'm going to be looking at uh, this twig right here that I brought in from outside to show you how to draw one. And I'm going to start by drawing the central part right here. And I'm just going to kind of lightly sketch in just a, a line that doesn't have to be perfectly straight but I'm going to look at the stick that I'm drawing, the twig. I'm going to draw the underside here. And it may not look exactly like it when I'm done but it'll have enough of the same features that it'll, it'll look good as a twig. Okay on this end there's a part that jots down right here so I'm going to draw that. And it's good to have something in front of you when you're drawing. Um, you might want to, you can watch what I'm doing here and follow along. And you can also later maybe go out and find a, your own stick to draw your own twig. Okay, this part's a little wider down here. And it curves around like that. Okay, right down on this end, there's a little knob right here. And it kind of juts out to the side. And there's a rough piece here on the end. A lot of drawing has to do with observation, looking at what you're drawing. Little knob here. And then there's one more kind of a piece sticking off right about here and it gets narrow and it, it's broken off right about here it's narrow at the end and then gets wider towards the main part here okay so that's roughly what the twig looks like and then I'm going to go back and draw there's little nodules all over I'm going to draw those and then I'm going to do some shading on this. This is a fairly simple drawing today, but you don't have to draw something complicated to have a good drawing. You can have draw something simple and make it look very nice. Okay, so these little emphasizing the, the bumps here, and then there's another little knob here, one down here, and one up out down here. Okay, I'm noticing that there's shadow along the bottom edge of this, so I'm going to draw that. There's kind of a little curve here, one under here. The shade underneath this. Some shadow along here. And I can use the the side of the pencil as well as the end to do some shading. I'm going to lightly go over the top. I want it to don't want it to just be white, but I do want it to be lighter than below. This piece here, Some extra lines there, a little bit of shadow here, on the underside. This is darker up here. Okay, and there's there's a few spots on this 
twig all the way down. So I'm just randomly put some spots here and there that don't want to make them too even. They should be fairly just not spaced out evenly, just randomly spaced. I think I'll go ahead and outline the whole thing, make it a little darker. Okay, go ahead and clean up your drawing, get rid of any extra lines, anything you don't need. You can add color if you'd like. And this is our drawing for today, a twig. Now that you know how to draw a twig, Take some time and go outside and go on a nature walk. You might even find something else that you'd like to draw. Well, that's all for now. Thank you for taking time to draw with me. I hope you'll come back again. And remember, if you want to be a good artist, do a little drawing every day. That's beautiful. I wonder if I could use my pencil.